Hi mathematicians, Mrs. Snyder here to teach you how to make your own balance scale using some items that you might have around your house. Today you're going to need a coat hanger, some sort of hanger. It could also be a paint stick or a small piece of wood that you could use to make your balance scale. You'll need two cups uh, that are the same size. These are the cups I happen to have at my house, but you may have some styrofoam cups or plastic cups. Uh, try to choose cups that are not breakable. You'll need some tape. I have painter's tape on hand, so that's what I'm using. And you'll need scissors to cut some yarn or string that you might have at your house. I have already cut my string, my yarn, here. Okay, And the yarn that you're going to cut, you're going to cut two pieces that are the same length or close to the same length, okay? And I've already done that here. All right, so your first task in this creation is to take one of your pieces of string or yarn, whatever you have it on hand, and you're going to drape it over the coat hanger, okay? And you want them to be about the same length on either side, okay? And you're gonna tie a knot in the string or the yarn, okay, just so it doesn't go too far when you're measuring the mass of objects. Okay. You're going to do the same thing on the other side, so you're going to take the yarn, loop it over, make sure it's about the same length on either side of the string, and then tie a knot. Now that you have your string on either side of your uh, hanger, you're going to take one cup and with one part of the string on one side, you're going to tape that to the cup with two pieces of painter's tape and I have those already here. And on the other side of the cup, about the same distance apart, I'm gonna go right across, you're going to tape the other piece of string side. So the idea is that the string is about the same distance apart so it balances as close to even as possible or equal as possible. Okay, so I'm just going to adjust my string there and so you will now have one part of your balance scale. You're going to repeat the same thing on the other side so you're going to take one of the two pieces of string that you have and you're going to tape one piece to one side. And you're going to tape one piece to the other side. And voila, you have a balance scale. You are now ready to compare the mass of different objects, just like this. Thanks for tuning in.